Bye-bye. Please don't forget about your teacher. <sighs> oh, fudge off. All right. Welcome back to another episode of Danganronpa 2. Goodbye, my waifu. Now, I'm pretty sure I said that before when uh, Ibuki died, but, um, yeah, this, this one... This one really hurts. Um... I say to myself that I think I'm I've I I'm mentally re uh, mentally prepared, but uh, uh, I'm pretty sure I'm not <laughs> in reality. Um, I still wish that we could just uh, grab Chiaki and just yeet out of here, but I mean, unless if we have Monomi's uh, magic wand or whatever, I'm sure that's pretty impossible. Um, so yeah, that's a damn shame. But uh, anyways. Let's just get this over with, shall we? Oh god, alright. Monokuma better not say anything... ...anything witty, I swear. I, this is not the time, dude. It's not fair. It really isn't. I... ...feel the same as everyone else. There's no way I can agree to this. Emptiness. Loneliness. Sadness. But most of all... I'm ashamed of my weakness. But, even so, I have to move forward. If we believe in the person who's urging us forward, then you gotta at least respect that. Then we have to start walking, and believe with as much hope as possible in what lies ahead. Oh boy, I have to do this again? Yo, man, that sprite is absolutely fitting. Oh gosh. Oh, dude. Bruh. Come on, man. What about for Yuhiko? And Akane. Oh, dude. <laughs> what if I just picked the wrong person? Uh. Actually, I kind of want to try what what happens, but... Nah, I, I shouldn't. You know what? Whatever. Even so. Even so, we have to move forward. Oh my gosh, no. Crap. Man... <sighs> Can somebody interrupt? No? Oh god, okay. We're really doing this. Oh no, please don't. Just get it- just get it over with. Man, I'm pooped. Let's go ahead and announce the result. Well, you just did. <laughs> <laughs> what was that noise? The traitor from the Future Foundation. And Nagito Komaira's killer is... Unintentionally... Chiaki Nanami. God damn. damn it. Man, it's crazy, because I was actually hoping that somehow, some way, it actually wasn't her. But, well... Now it's confirmed. Are you serious? That was correct? Right? It's kind of weird, because we all voted for her, and yet we still couldn't believe it. The fact that Chiaki was a traitor... The fact that Nagato's crime depended entirely on his luck. Uh, it's crazy. Everything was true? Damn it. Plus, that means that bastard managed to pull it off. The most dangerous talent I have ever seen, truly. Ugh. Oh, Chiaki, please. Congratulations, everyone. No, stop. Just shush. Just shush. I I I don't know. Damn it. Stupid. We're not celebrating at all. Damn it. Chiaki, let me ask you one more time. Are you really part of the Future Foundation? We all thought Future Foundation, um, was like, the bad guys, right? But... I mean, after hearing that Chiaki and Monomi is part of the group, I... No, it can't be. As a matter of fact, Future Foundation, right? It has the word future in it, so it sounds to me like it's like... A hope organization. So maybe they were actually trying to save us. Huh. An agent of the organization that brought us to this island? Is that really your true identity? I feel like it's not, though. I'm sorry I didn't tell you guys. Wait, so the Future Foundation... Oh, right, right. They, they did say that. Future Foundation brought us here, but... Huh. What? Shh. That is... I cannot believe it. Even though I do not want to believe it. There's no choice but to believe, right? Unfortunately... I'm sorry. Bro, there has to be more to this. I... It would have been better if I could have said it sooner. 
But I couldn't say it no matter what. Cause... I can't betray the future foundation. Fair enough. Can't betray? Well... Even if you want to fly, you can't, right? Even if you want to swim where you please, you can't, right? Um... Okay, I get what you're saying. Um... It's the same for me. Due to the nature of my existence, I will never be able to betray the future foundation. She mentioned that before. About her existence. What does that mean? Like... Like, because I was... Ex like, I, I existed that way? Like, what... What the heck? But in the end, you did something similar. What you did is no different than sharing your secret yourself. <laughs> You're right. Oh my gosh, dude. <sighs> Why? Like, can you like... I don't know... Act like a... Act like a bitch, so I, I, I kinda hate you or something? I, <sighs> I don't know, dude. <sighs> is there a way I can hate you, Chiaki, please? Like, now's not the time to be laughing. Well? But strangely enough, I don't have any regrets. No, dude, you- say that you hate us or something, please, I- ugh. Act like- uh, uh, act like, um, Mikan or something, dude, please. In fact, I'm somewhat happy. Okay, I'm mentally prepared. I'm- 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 I'm prepared, okay, alright. I was able to think I wanted to protect everyone. That's why I feel proud of my actions. Oh my gosh, no. Uh, you're still saying things I don't get, but... If we ask you anything, you're just not gonna answer, right? Right, because, I mean, that would be betraying the future foundation. Ugh. Like, if we ask why you're the FF and stuff... Yeah, she can't. I'm sorry. That is... E even if you were a traitor... Man, she has to be, like, the nicest traitor of all time. Oh, man. You never betrayed us. Right, and she didn't mean to. I mean, like, wait a minute. How is she even a traitor anyways? Because, I mean... I mean, that... Uh, like, she hasn't really betrayed us, has she? She always helped us. Yeah, I mean, I, that's just... Uh. Chiaki, you will always be our friend. Even now. Oh, dude. We don't blame you for this. That's why you don't need to apologize. Oh, dear. Yeah. So the traitor was revealed and Chiaki lost. In the end, it all went according to Nagito's plan, huh? God damn it, dude. I... Couldn't you... Couldn't he just have told us? I... Like... Why did it, I mean, well, actually, no, the result would have been the same, except Nagito would have been alive, but... Ah, uh, man. Now, about that... Was that really... Nagito's goal? Oh, God, what now? Is it really okay to say he was trying to find the killer and eliminate them? If so, isn't it strange? C why, because he died too? Strange? So... I mean, we nearly lost, right? I mean, yeah, but he probably believed in us. And if Chucky hadn't said anything, we definitely would have lost. Oh god. Well, I mean, he again, he probably relied on his luck for uh, something like this to happen. Basically, literally, he can just use his talents to make anything happen the way he thinks it will. I, uh, I mean, this, you can take over the world with that kind of talent, I feel like. <laughs> you raised a good point. That's exactly it. Oh, really? Even though Nagito said he would weed out the traitor, he never said he would kill the tra Huh? Wait. What? What does that mean? Wait, nah. I mean, no, Malika was still gonna execute her, surely. Huh? Yes, indeed! Congratulations! You successfully stopped Nagito's plan! Wait, what? What? I mean, Nagito's plan was to reveal the traitor. <laughs> and kill everyone else besides the traitor. Oh. Oh. Wait, what? what's the point of that? What? That's even more... Unreasonable. What? Kill everyone else besides the traitor. What? Huh? Kill everyone else besides the traitor? Are you that serious? That was Nagito's goal? Huh? Why would he do something like that? Exactly, of all to, to form a plan that only the traitor would survive. Is that bastard really that twisted? Yeah, probably. Nope. It's okay. Okay, what? Hmm. 
Well, actually... Oh, so Nagito didn't calculate the fact that Chiaki would reveal herself? Hmm. Well? I mean, it's not just Nagito's fault. Are you gonna say it's my fault? If the circumstances had been different, he probably wouldn't have taken things so far. Huh? Ch Chihaki! You really are a kind-hearted person. She really is. And so are you, Monomi. I'm sorry I, uh, doubted you. I mean, uh, what? Mm. But I still don't know who Monomi is. Like, who's controlling her? The Future Foundation? Like, from far away? Or... Huh? You think so? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I wonder where you got your personality from. What? Perhaps... Maybe our dad and our big brother. Don't you think? You have a big brother? Oh. I remember um, from the free time that she had a dad, but... Huh, she hasn't mentioned uh, her mother yet. That's interesting. Hey! hey. Come on now. Don't go talking about your family all of a sudden. That's totally ripping off Teru Teru. Teru Teru? Oh, oh, I see what you mean. <laughs> I can't lose! I cannot lose to Chiaki! Huh? Just like Chiaki and everyone else, even if I know it's a fight, I cannot win! I must try to retaliate! Okay, so you're gonna fight for Chiaki, I got you. Huh? Retaliate? Oh, you're gonna fight? Oh. <laughs> I will no longer let you do as you please. Um what what you doing? <laughs> Stupid stop! What are you doing? As they say, we shall die together. <laughs> um well, actually, this kind of reminds me of another Dragon Ball Z reference, but... They can't die, though. <laughs> this is definitely a Dragon Ball Z reference. Oh my gosh, dude. <laughs> she, she self-destructed. What is... What's going on? What was the point of that, though? They can just come back. Huh? Monokuma, like, died? No, yeah. No. I'm not dead. A new effing a new one came out. Man, that surprised me. If only I didn't have a spear, I would have died. Really? I doubt that though. <laughs> I'm not done yet. She's gonna do it again. Wait, bruh. If I don't beat you, nobody can live in peace. Stop it, I say. I'm sorry. I lose. Forgive me. <laughs> what is going on, dude? Are there is there gonna be like an endless amount of explosions? Hey, hey. Not yet. <laughs> if you don't stop right now, it's not gonna be destroyed. I won't forgive you. I'm doing it so you all be destroyed. What do you mean all? Oh, you mean all of Monokuma? Hopefully, right? I will be the one to protect my students. I won't let you. I will protect them with my life. Nomi, you. How many of you are still there? You might as well come out all at once! Ooh, uh, how many? <laughs> Not that much. Just around 10 to the 60 power. Oh. Well. That's gonna take a while? <laughs> how <-wa> <laughs> What did you say? What? what? No, that's not 1 million. That's not even a... I don't even think there's a word for that. 1 million. <sighs> oh god. One, ten, one hundred thousand? Ten thousand million billion trillion quadrillion? Jump ahead. Ten to fifty-two, fifty-six, and then ten to sixty power. <laughs> That's ten to the sixtieth power, well. <gasps> wow. Wait, what? How do you fit that many in, in an island? That's impossible. No, there's no way that's true. No, can you imagine that many Monokumas? No. No, there's no way you can fit. Like, that would... That would feel like a whole country. Hey, hey. After all this, you're still joking around. You sure have quite the daring spirit. Right, I mean, he must be joking, but I mean, I'm sure he has thousands regardless, but... Too bad. Except I'm not joking. <laughs> <laughs> what are you even saying anymore? Did you see that scene? What, the... The factory? I mean, yeah, but... <laughs> While you're doing this, my clones are continuously and endlessly created. But 10 to the 60? Nah. In the Monokuma Manufacturing Facility. Okay. That's wrong. 
Wait, why not just bomb that? Oh wait, no, bombs don't really. Wait, did they explain how um, Nagito got that bomb? No, that was from the. Never mind. Yeah, that was from the uh, FDR, right? But what? Those were just stuffed animals. No. No, those no, those were actual monokumas. Th that's right. Oh, I actually um assumed that those were actual replicas. Oh, I didn't know they didn't know. I checked them with my own hands. They're just plushies. But that's how they actually operate. Damn it! Right? You're just bluffing. Manomi, finish him off. Hey, even um... if it's just a plushie, as long as you give it Monokuma's personality. It becomes a fully developed Monokuma. That makes no sense. Um, what? As long as you give it a personality. Wait, what are we even doing? Can we just get the execution over with, please? What, what did you say? Th there's no way that's possible. That's not even magic. <laughs> magic, huh? <laughs> okay. Wait, are they actually gonna tell- Well, no. They, uh, the first game said that Monokuma's a machine, though. But if it really is a plushie, then... Hmm. Could it be? Have you already obtained that much power? What? What is going on? What? Well, now that I think about it, though, um, in the first game, it was mentioned that Monokuma's, um, a robot, like a high-tech robot, but... We confirmed that it was a plushie because we managed to look inside. Now that I think about it... But what? What? I mean, I don't really care about this right now, though. Hey, hey, hey. So, hold on. If you bring up magic so suddenly, we're gonna be so confused. You know, maybe if we keep talking like this, maybe we can distract Monokuma and, um... <laughs> just get out of here. I doubt it. Unless you mean magic in a technological sense, we won't understand this at all. Hey, hey. What's going on? Don't tell me. You're gonna call this magic or something? Hmm. I don't care how you interpret it. What? Oh, wow. In the end, even if Monami risks her life or does whatever, it doesn't matter to my army of 10 to the power of 60 strong! Damn. No, there- I mean, how do you- I mean, let's say Monokuma is like, what? Um, 3 feet tall? 10 to the 60 power times 3 feet tall? Like, no, that's- that would flood the whole island. Like, no value in that life you're risking. But then again, this is a fictional game, so yeah. <laughs> so how about this? This overwhelming despair! Does it make you dizzy from excitement? Yeah, totally. What's this? And how many Monomis are left to challenge my army of 10 to the 60? Yeah, how many- Oh, no, she only has like a dozen, right? <laughs> <laughs> you don't have to say anything, huh? I know. Let's see, you have like 10 more left, right? Oh, so she did have 12, okay. I know everything! I am the conqueror of the new world! Okay... I can't lose! Even if I have no chance of winning, I... And Chiaki's gonna tell her to stop. It's okay, Monami. Yep, oh god. Hmm? Well? It's not about giving up, you know? Let's believe in them. Let's believe in everyone, and leave the rest to them. Yeah, um, totally. Um, Hashime's gonna carry the load now, for sure. Yeah, with the, um, with our lovely sidekick Akane and Kazuichi, yeah. Alright. I... But, but... Right? No, I don't know, dude. I don't know about this. Damn it. What the hell's going on? Um... I, I do not know for certain, but the only thing I can say is... Please listen! Monokuma is an enemy of the Future Foundation. Well, I'm glad you figured that out. Like... Does that mean... There's another organization that's our enemy besides the Future Foundation? But my guess is that the Future Foundation is actually on our side. Man, if Chiaki's just one... Person that's... <laughs> in the Future Foundation... Imagine like the whole gang... Dang. This is bad. We're in the situation because we're caught up in a dispute between these two organizations? Huh. Damn it. Okay, that's it. Let's just leave that talk for later. Because, 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 because the punishment time's gonna start. Yep, not as much. Ugh. Oh, hold on. Just a little more. Just a little more time. Shing. To wait or not to wait. That is the question. But which will cause more despair? 
That's the real question. Oh god, what would cost more to spare, actually? Well, probably waiting it out will, actually, yeah. <laughs> if you think about it, you know, right? There's no way I'd wait. Really, because if you wanted us to see more despair, then you would probably do. You would wait, but... But... I haven't. I'm sorry. Hajime... Regardless, there's nothing else I can say. I'm not allowed to say anything more than I already have. Seriously, though, what does that mean? Like, I'm not allowed... What? She sounds like she's being controlled or something. But she's about to die, so does it matter? I mean... Not that, I... Prepared a very oh god, here punishment. we go. The ultimate gamer for Chiaki Minami. Special bleeding service. For Minami to What? Why? Well, I mean she's not gonna die, so I guess that's okay, but uh, uh, right. Huh? Oh no. Just to piss Chiaki off. Oh my gosh. Wow. Why even Minami? It's just a two for one special. Huh? Yeah. It's to piss you off, Chiaki. <laughs> I could have killed that thing anytime I wanted since he's not a student. And also, I don't need anybody that will defy me anymore. Um, Monomi is gonna come back to her, right? Uh huh. Huh, also, I remember now. <laughs> I'm an only child. Right, sure. I mean, I figured that out. That is... What? What is that? Huh? <sighs> it's okay. Wait, so you're telling me Monokuma was just playing along? What the hell? Damn, he really is cocky, isn't he? It's okay. Even if I'm here, I'd just be a burden anyway. And not just that. Oh my god, don't talk like that, dude. I, I'm so s- I'm- I, I apologize for doubting you, okay? Like... Ugh... Akane, you better apologize too, dude. <laughs> I've decided to believe in everyone! Oh no. All right, let's get this over with. Oh my god. Guys, I'm, I'm sorry, sorry about so. Oh so my god. Oh I'm no. Sorry for lying to you. What? What did she lie about? I'm sorry. I couldn't protect you to the very end. Um. Well, actually, you kind of did. Um. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. Unless if you mean I can't protect you anymore, but. Just one last time. Let me say something that makes me sound like a teacher. Bro, what is this? This is not okay. I, I, <sighs> There's no need to be a hero. Oh my gosh. You don't have to force yourself just to make people acknowledge you. Oh gosh, alright. Monomi, you just had to make things worse. God damn it, as always. When you do that, you end up blaming yourself, blaming other people, and feeling jealous of everyone. But still... It doesn't have to be like that. Even if people don't acknowledge you, you just have to be someone that you can be proud of. <laughs> Why are you talking like this now? Why could you act like- Because <laughs> you yourself are your biggest supporter. Oh my god, dude. Call me names. Call me stupid. I don't know. Just- uh, What? If you can learn to love yourself, that love will continue to support you for the rest of your life. Yeah, shut up. I... Love, love. No, 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 stop. I... No. Oh my god. Bye, everyone. No, stop. No. No, dude. It's okay. A shining future will always be waiting for you. It's true. It's absolutely true. Cuz... <laughs> I know. Bye-bye! Please don't forget about your teacher! <sighs> oh, fudge off, dude. Let's give it everything we've got! It's punishment time! <laughs> Shoot! Damn it, I need a tissue. God damn it. Oh my god. Oh fudge, dude! I thought I was prepared. I was, I was, I was wrong. The punishment hasn't even started yet. God damn it! Oh, this is not. This ain't right, dude. This is. This should be illegal. I. What is this, dude? Bro. 
What? Oh my god, he's gonna execute all Monomis? He really is killing Monomi. Oh, jeez. Please insert coin? Okay. Oh, God. All right. What? What? Oh, dude, this is not cool, dude. Seeing Shaki's face like that is just... Oh, my gosh, dude. Oh, Monomi. Oh! Oh my... Uh, you might want to move out the way- oh, okay, well. Ah! Gosh! No! No, dude. Oh, God. Ugh. Wow, they really... They really didn't hold back. Oh my gosh, dude. They really didn't hold back. I was hoping that she would just get obliterated with the tank bullet, but wow, they really... Ugh. The part that got me the most wasn't that Tetris part, it was the, um... It was the part when she was trying to run away, you saw her face. That... Man, that, that, that broke me a little. Oh my gosh. Even until the very end, I couldn't look away from Chucky's final moments. Without realizing it, I had fallen to my knees. A feeling of powerlessness spread throughout my body. It's over. It just had to end. Before I could ask what I needed to ask, before I could ask what I needed to say, Chucky vanished before my eyes. And I couldn't even tell her thank you. If I had said that, would she have been... Comforted a little? She was executed as the traitor. Would she have been com comforted a little? I don't know. My chest just hurt. I don't believe it! That was such a big surprise, yeah. Okay. Oh man. Alright, well I'm glad that part's over. Um Shoot. Ugh. That's for Chiaki. She regularly took on the role of appointment during the class trials. As did Nagito too, right. I mean, Chiaki and Nagito were like our pillars for this game. I mean, how are we gonna move on? Like, Hajime may be the protagonist, but Chiaki and Nagito were truly just... I mean, the engine, the... The, the work. And Nagito was just like a narrator, really. <laughs> what? And not only was she the traitor, she was Nagito's killer too. Oh well, don't worry about it. There won't be any more situations where you'll need to rely on them. Yeah, that's the issue, dumbass. Ugh. Huh? Wait, does that mean... Hmm. Not that the annoying rabbit is gone as... Dude, I thought he was just gonna eliminate one Monomi and then come back, but he actually... <sighs> Dude, I feel so bad... For Monomi. Uh... Ugh. Like... Uh, I wish... At the very least, like, Akane told her, I'm sorry for, like, I don't know... All the things I said at the very- <sighs> I wish I was there to, like, tell her that or something, but... All of the obstacles that have been keeping us stuck on this island are completely gone. Did wait What? So there's another thing? Oh my god, there's gonna be chapter 6, isn't there? Hey! Are you serious? We can really leave this- Oh no, that was the trap, wasn't it? By him saying leaving this island, he meant this island, but we're gonna go to another island that's not part of the five islands. Is that what he meant? And the reason why we couldn't go there in the first place was because of the because of Monomi and Chiaki. I shall now present. Wait, what? With this, I shall announce the end of the killing school trip. Oh. 
Okay, so maybe I was wrong. For you five who've survived until now, I shall give you the right to graduate. Oh. What? <sighs> Thank you for all your hard work. Are, are you really okay with that? Hmm? What do you mean? There's still two days left. If you were acting like your usual self, you would be setting things up so another killing happens right away. <sighs> You're right. Well, don't tell- don't remind him, just... Stop it! What are you saying? What if Mr. Monokuma changes his mind? <laughs> Why did you mention Mr.? Also, you said you five like you were emphasizing that part. Does that number of people matter more than the remaining time? That's why you, you're you saying it's the end already, even though there are still two days left, right? Huh? It matters? That there are five people left? It does? I mean, there are five islands, but I don't see the connection. And there were five survivors in the first game as well, but... Are you planning to make a volleyball team? <laughs> or a basketball team? Wait, I thought volleyball was six. Eh, I don't know. Stupid fool. Oh, yeah, I was gonna say. You need six people for volleyball. Okay. Don't stay quiet. Say something. I mean, I, I still don't know who Monomi is, though. And I, we still don't know who Monokuma is. There's still way too many questions. There has to be another chapter, surely. What's your actual purpose? You're our enemy and an enemy of the future foundation, so what's your true identity? Hey, um... If the future foundation is the world ender... Uh... Okay. Then I will end the new world that the future foundation has created. Huh? No, no! Well, you just have to look forward to the rest after the countdown ends. Okay... <laughs> That timer has almost reached zero. If it reaches zero, everything will end. The future foundation's lame plan will be nothing but toilet bubbles. Okay. Hey, um... And when that time comes, you'll know everything. You'll see all of your questions answered in one go. Hmm. And then, you guys will find out for yourselves just how messed up this new world is. Huh, I feel like the new world is actually the world that Trigger Happy Havoc kids were in. Well, actually, no, because we don't even know what the actual world is like, right? Because we're in a virtual, like, tropical island that... I, I don't even... Uh, hey, hey. Huh? A new world? You go saying new shit like all of a sudden? Yep. Well, just think of the remaining two days until the countdown reaches zero as a bonus. <laughs> While you're at it, you should enjoy your life on this tropical island to the fullest. Because once you leave this island... Shing. Your hopeless lives back home will be waiting for you. Yep, that sounds like Trigger Happy Havoc. Oh god. Wait, uh, wait a minute, so... It, wait, no, it kind of makes sense now that I think about it. If the world is as bad as, you know, the... What, what what was it? Like, the history's worst event. You know, you know that long phrase. The worst possible... Yeah, whatever. That means outside this tropical island, the world is in blazes, right? Like how Trigger Happy Havoc showed us. That's probably what Monokuma means. Now, the Future Foundation is the one that sent us here. And that's probably a good thing, right? Because that they're, they were trying to save us from dying. So yeah, I think Future Foundation is actually a, an ally. I feel like. Yeah, it has to be. <laughs> Shut the hell up. <laughs> you have to say it twice, okay. And that concludes the final chapter. Oh man, what a chapter that was. I mean, that was trash, but... Onakuma's boisterous laughter carried on for what felt like forever. Our questions, our worries, our sadness were simply ignored. The laughter just kept on going forever. As for what we did afterwards... Honestly, it doesn't matter at all. <laughs> yeah, it really doesn't. Man. Why are we still here? I thought we were gonna leave. I, I returned to my cottage for the time being and fell asleep. Yeah, I knew it wouldn't be that easy. Oh wow, it's morning, wow. Even after I woke up, my will to move my body didn't come back. That's why. I didn't look back on everything that happened up till now. I didn't think about what was going to happen. I just kept praying that nothing else would happen. And buried deep into my sheets as if I were trying to hide. Oh wow, so you're just gonna sleep for two days? Man, I was hoping we would actually get to spend some free time at least, but yeah, I mean, it makes sense. They don't want to do that. Ugh. Damn. In doing so, I was somehow trying to endure the long day. 
And it's gonna be night? Oh my gosh. And then the fi sun finally set. The day feels abnormally long when you spend it praying that nothing happens. Which reminds me... I haven't heard Monokuma's announcement. Oh, that is kind of strange, actually. I guess... That isn't needed anymore. Is everything really going to end? What is everything, anyway? How far, how much is everything? If we leave this island, is everything going to end? There's still so much we don't know. Exactly, we don't know. And I still- I'm, I, I still don't know, um, if you guys remember back in, like, chapter 1 or 2, I think? When, uh, when Hajime was looking up at the sky, he saw something. We still don't know what that was. I'm assuming it was a camera, but... I don't know, that just came to my mind. About our school memories. <laughs> that too, yeah. The Future Foundation, yep. <laughs> Hope Speak Academy, Monokuma's true purpose. His true identity, like, Monomi's identity, which doesn't really matter anymore, but still. Can we really end this and turn our back on all that? Yep, otherwise it's, it's gonna happen again. Well, actually, even if we figure that all out, it's probably gonna happen again, but... And not just that. If we're really leaving, then where are we going? Wow, he's really thinking deep now, huh? To... HPA? Well... That pla- is that pla- well, I don't even know anymore. I don't, that was my last night at Jabberwock Island. That was my last night? Oh. Okay. At a place where my worries didn't even matter. Everything was about to end. Oh boy. Oh, we finally get to see what it is. I think. Fifth- wait, what? 8 hours and 55, okay. Oh boy, I feel like I had a fun dream. Somehow. Oh god, are you gonna say like you spend time with Chiaki? Oh, okay. I think it was my, my childhood. Because of that, I was able to face the day with a somewhat happier feeling than usual. That's right. It's the last day. According to Monokuma. Everything's gonna end, right? Suddenly, my body shuddered. Right when I opened my eyes, I was gripped by a fear that I had never felt before. A fear like I had been abandoned in this world. Completely, utterly alone. But nobody left on this island. Kazuichi, Fuyuhiko, Akane, Sonia. Like everyone was gone and I couldn't find them anywhere. I suddenly couldn't believe in anything, like everything in this world was nothing but lies. Whoa, what? I rushed out of the cottage, desperate to escape that fear. I rushed out of the cottage, that's- Um... What? Has he gone insane? What? Oh... I see what's happening. Right, I forgot at the beginning this happened too. Right, I totally forgot about that, this virtual thing, right. Wait, what? Uh... Okay... When I left the cottage, I randomly ran into her. Hello there. Oh, hell no! No, 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 no. Don't do this. No. Why? Why do you have to do- I- No, I just got over it! I don't wanna see- <sighs> Good timing. What do you mean? See? Remember Nakito's video message that we found at the factory? Yeah, when we were dealing with the bomb ruckus. What about it? What? Why is Hajime acting like this is normal? What? Did we go back in time? Nah, dude, don't... I'm so confused right now. Well, Apparently there was more to that message inside that laptop. Huh? Yep. We weren't able to see it until a day or so had passed. Apparently it was locked by a timer. Hmm. Did he set it up so we wouldn't be able to watch it until after the class trial? Wait, what? Did she just say after the class trial? Wait, what? So we didn't go back in time? I'm so confused right now. What? Maybe Nagito planned to leave this as a will. Nagito's what? Where is it right now? Um, we were just planning to meet at the restaurant and watch it together. G got it. The restaurant. Um. What? Wait, time out. What? Hold on. If it's the present time, then it should say these guys are dead. Oh, okay, yeah. Dead, dead, dead. Okay. Oh. Yeah. 
Yeah, okay. So she is dead, but... What? I'm assuming this is like, um... Like an illusion of some sort by uh, Monokuma, which is kind of messed up, to be honest, but... Ugh, what... What is going on? It seems like he... Like, whoever is doing this, like, just changed scenery, like... I don't know yeah. how to describe it. Oh, wow, aren't you happy? Hey, you're late! Oh, wait, no, Chiagi's here, that's why. Is it true? Nagito really left another message? Kneel before Miss Sonia Danker. She was the one who found it. <laughs> I was going for a walk with Gundam's hamster. I was gonna say, if you said Gundam, I would've freaked out. And I found it when I stopped by the factory. Can I see the hamsters, please? Listen well. Oh. Oh. Okay, something's definitely- Wait, what? I just- Oh my gosh! I just realized this Gundam! Oh my god! I got from- Oh my goodness, I was so... Freaked out by that static, but- Wait, what? A coincidence, you say? Wrong. That is the will of causality guiding you. So is everyone alive right now? What? Why would Masonia be going for a walk with Gundam? I never allow that! Damn yeah. Right. So anyway, let's hurry up and play it. Yeah, you're right. Wait, what? What about Terra Terra and all those guys? Oh, okay. Mm, I wonder who's watching this message. Is it the traitor from the Future Foundation? If so, congratulations. Looks like it ended the way I hoped it would. Ended the hope? Ended the way he hoped it would. Huh. Damn it. Nagito was trying to kill everyone except the traitor. Damn it. It was just as Monokuma said. What? Wait, no, we didn't go back in time. This is so confusing. What? Wait, wh what? Why is Gundam alive then? What? What? So this is after the fifth trial, but everyone survived. Somehow. Hey, hey. So he really set up the traitor as the killer? And he even tried to make them survive the trial? But why would he do that? <laughs> what the hell? Okay, what what is going on here? Uh, enough with your useless talk. It appears there's still more. Um... Okay, I... But if everyone but the traitor is watching this video... <laughs> what if I told you it's both? How unfortunate. Then unfortunately, I guess I lost. That outcome is the complete opposite of the hope I believe in. Well, not that it matters for me anymore. I mean, no matter what the outcome is, it doesn't matter for a dropout like me. Now then. Let's put this meaningless introduction aside and get down to business. Since I don't know who I'm talking to, I'm going to speak so that both sides will understand. First of all, you might be wondering why. I did what I did. Well, I just took action after talking about it for so long. The special prize in the final dead room allowed me to learn a certain truth. Okay? It would be troublesome if everyone found out. So I already disposed of that page. Oh, okay, that makes sense. But anyway, I was totally surprised, I mean... <laughs> what? <laughs> Yin Yang Omen Chim Ter Kakapa Spasm 03R49 Old Kapter. Okay, got it, totally. The future foundator, Foundation's traitor must have known that truth all along. Wait, but what What? Are, what am I looking at right now, though? Like, this isn't reality. Are we, like, trapped in the... Well, yeah, we're trapped in the virtual world, but, like... And so, I was able to learn the truth about this world, and resolved to take action immediately. I shouldn't have made fun of Hajime. Deep down, I always wanted to become a protagonist myself. Honestly, he could have been. What? What? What is this? Like... But now that I know the truth, as I look back on Monokuma's actions, I'm starting to see what he's planning. By giving us information about the island's mystery and the future foundation, he's raising all your hopes. And then smashing them all? But only so he can lead you to unimaginable despair. <laughs> Plus, Monokuma's trying to show that despair to someone. Perhaps that someone is. And it's gonna crash again. Yep. Seriously pissing me off. Hella. 
Nice. Uh, can't believe something good. Um, I'm trying to read this. Hold on. Good. Something it is only. Hunt. Oh God. Happy. It's happy ores. Okay. Jeez. What a hopeless truth. Who's Monokuma's true identity? How could they come up with a plan like that? Now then. That's enough reflecting on the past. Let's talk about the future now. You want to escape Monokuma's plan? There's a specific place you need to go to. The key to enter that place is that message you found at Nezumi Castle. Huh? Oh, oh, the password, yeah. I feel like I can read that, though. <laughs> well, Normally, you need to follow a bunch of steps to enter that place. But since that message gets rid of those steps, you can think of it as an easter egg or something. What? I'm sorry, what? You need to follow a bunch of steps, but since that message gets rid of those steps, you can think of it as an easter egg. Huh? It was probably left by someone other than Monokuma or Monomi. But that has nothing to do with me. You guys were still thinking you're not gonna do something to stop it. Don't stop. Okay. I had to hide this until my plan came to an end, but I guess now's the ni nice time to announce it, right? So then, I'll announce the password. Yeah, <laughs> it's not gonna be that easy, is it? Oh my god. You gotta be kidding me, dude. Are you kidding? <laughs> Come on. I think I predicted 14037, and I had a feeling it was actually this. I just... Oh my gosh. Really, Leon? Ugh. Leon's the traitor! Ugh. It's the password that was written in Nezumi Castle. You have to use that to enter that specific place. That's the only way you can save Monokuma. I feel like I've been talking forever, but... That's all for me. With this, my duty is finished. I... I believe my actions will become the foundation of this world's hope. And, if that really happens, praise me. I kind of want to, actually. If I understood what the heck was going on. Wait. Wait, so all this... Wait, what? Is this Nakito's doing right now? Like, this, this virtual weird world? Like... I, uh, tell others what I've accomplished. Erect... <laughs> erect a bronze statue of me. Respect me. Yeah, Please sure. Call me the ultimate hope. Yeah, sure, buddy. Um, well, I mean, you are helping us trying to escape, so if it works out, maybe. But that was weird. This was Nagito's final message. Um, that 11037 number that Nagito said was the password. Uh, what the? Oh my god, dude. Ugh, this is so weird. What? Why is everyone acting normal? There's no mistaking it. That's the password to enter that ancient ruin. Hey, hey my hero. You better hurry. I think. Let's go before the countdown reaches zero. You're right, let's go. I'm so lost. What? No one's gonna complain. Like, no. No one's going to act like. This is abnormal. Wait, 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 no one's gonna act like- no one's gonna question this? My hero's alive, so what's the point of this? We're always together, right. Oh my god, this is so creepy! What is go- yo, like, can you help me out here? Damn right. Looks like the others have left already, okay. Let's crush- There's nothing to worry about since everyone's here. That's the issue, dude, what? What? Okay, I am kind of freaking out right now, um... But okay, I'll play along. What the hell? Wait, is Mikan here then? <laughs> what the hell? So I have to go here, right? Oh, I can't teleport. Okay. What the hell? Now's not the time to relax. I need to hurry to the ancient ruin. Oh. Um. What the? Um. Wow, this kind of reminds me of, um, that, uh, Doki Doki Literature Club. <laughs> I, I've been mentioning that game quite a, quite a bit, actually, when playing Danganronpa. Because, you know, in that game, too, they kind of messed up with the game files, and this kind of looks like that, too. What? What is going on? 
Yeah, everything... Wait, this kind of reminds me of the Midnight Game thing from Chapter 3. But... Um... So somehow, it is quite nerve-wracking. Racking? Oh. Yeah. Is it really safe to go inside? What's gonna be in there? You are a boy, right? Oh my gosh, dude. <sighs> What? What? Are we in like a dream? What? Is, uh, it's so unre unreliable to be freaked out like that. You're a man, aren't you? Yep, that's definitely my hero. <laughs> There's also that countdown. There's no time to stand around. I'm gonna do it. Damn right. It's our last chance to get inside. <laughs> oh my gosh, she's here. I'm starting to feel nauseous from the thrills, the chills, the. What? <laughs> Why is she talking like that? That's Monokuma's line. Thanks. For Oh my gosh, ah, if you're gonna let it out, why not do it in the Tupperware I keep with me? Man, dude, I miss this dude. Dumbass. Hey, now's the time to F around? Yo, imagine everyone surviving in Gink to Chapter 5. That'd be amazing. Man, what? Wait, who hasn't shown up yet? I feel like there's still someone missing, um... Unless, of course, if I'm mistaken. Ibuki hasn't showed up yet, and Pekko, huh. And Hiyoko, yeah. Oh, there they are. Oh my gosh, that is such a sweet face. It's going to be alright. You don't have to worry. I will protect my young master. Now then, let's go forward together. Yeah, actually, if I have Pekko with us, I would probably feel safe. <laughs> the hell? Don't treat me like a child. This is your leader's order. Believe that hope lies beyond this point. That is your leader's order. <laughs> oink, oink. <laughs> <laughs> Nah, dude, this is too happy right now. This is too weird. I... What? What was that? <laughs> and there she is. I told her that you only understand piggy talk. Oh my gosh, dude. This is so adorable, but... <sighs> I said you're so cool in piggy talk. <laughs> in the name of my family. I'm going to kill you. <laughs> Hajime. The password, please. What? You type it. Just kidding. Yeah, I know. Huh, I wonder why I can't see their sprites though. Hmm. I mean, they're like a, you know, 2D cardboard version, but anyways. 11037, right? It's gonna be fine. There's no need for you to worry. The only thing beyond this point is a shining future. Yeah, sure, Chiaki. I hope I can believe that. Now then, let's open the door to the future. Um... I don't know, I feel like <laughs> this is just a hunch, but I feel like it's gonna be the door to <laughs> despair, but... Leon! Of course. He used the mastermind all along, I knew it. Ugh, silly Leon. Beyond this door, the future is waiting. Um... Are you sure about that? A sparkling future, yeah, okay. Now then, let's move forward. Um... Uh... Um, alright. Oh yeah, that's that's the future right there. Oh yes. Hmm. What? That's it? There. What? It's just a one gigantic room. Nah, we must have teleported. Surely this can't be it. Is this a trial ground? Yeah, this can't be. Nah. But why am I at a trial ground? Why am I even here? It sure looks like a trial ground, but the vibe is way different than the one from before. Yeah. No kidding. Um. By the way. Huh? Um, where did everyone go? Oh, the ones who actually died? Wait, what is going on? It's like... Did... Whoever's doing this messed up our memories and... What? Hmm? Everyone? What? Something's wrong. Yeah, uh, no, no kidding. What did I do? What? It sounds to me like someone messed up our memories and is making us hallucinate. What? No, that's not it. I'm not the weird one. What's really weird is... Uh, the world, maybe? What? Oh my gosh, this world. Wow, I got it. Um... Oh. 
I am so confused, but okay, whatever. Um. Uh. Wait, are you- you're actually gonna destroy the island? No, right? Oh. Stage clear? Right, because this is like a virtual world, so that makes sense, but... What? Six, five. Right. <laughs> I thought I was gonna say 15 or something. Okay... What? Please tell me they're gonna answer all these questions. Um... Okay. Chapter Z- Wait, what? Oh, we're going back to the beginning. Okay. Heading to the school trip. Alright. It would be wrong to say it was swaying from side to side. It was actually shaking rather intensely. The room I was in was shaking from side to side. The shaking was quite irregular, just when you thought it was a series of small shakes. It was suddenly shake violently. And every time that happened, I'd have to steady myself with my foot. Uh, okay, are you being shipped on a ship or something? I couldn't stand up very well, but for me, it was comforting. I never thought not knowing what to expect could be so fun, so I was feeling rather excited. But I figured I'd get bored of that feeling soon enough. That's what I was expecting. For me, a person who is loved by talent. Detecting irregularities among irregularities won't be that difficult. Ah, how boring. Wait, what? That sounds like a detective. Oh, it's Nagi. Wait, what? I am so confused. What is go Oh wait, this must be when he was going to Hope's Peak- uh, uh, the island, I'm assuming. Do you... like ships? Wait, what? On the other side of the dark room, I heard a voice. It was clearly directed at me- No, this must be Hajime. Oh wait, at the very beginning of the game, we saw Nagito looking down at Hajime. Right, so... yeah, okay. <laughs> You look like you were having fun, so that's what I assumed. You do like ships, right? Ships? Ah, that's right. That's it. So this is a ship. <laughs> you just realized that now? Is it really that funny? Hey, if you want, care to talk a little? The silence was starting to bore me. Instantly, I saw his true character. The overfamiliar attitude, that friendly smile. But under that thin skin, I could detect a foul, offensive odor. Like some kind of putrid slime. In a sensible way, of course. How should I put this? It was a smell exclusive to those who were already finished. Uh... You mean someone who's already dead, or...? Nice to meet you. I'm Nagito Komaeda. Anyway... Lucky... Me. It's been a while since anyone was willing to talk to me. So to share a room with a person like that... Yep, I'm definitely lucky. Lucky? Ah, so that's your talent then. <laughs> what? How, how can you figure that out just by that? What a boring talent. Um... What? Well, I guess Hajime would say something like that, actually, yeah. Boring talent, huh? Well, that's exactly what it is. But for someone I'm meeting for the first time to say that so suddenly... Yeah, I was gonna say, that's kinda... I don't know, not even Hajime might say that. Well, I don't even know if this is Hajime, actually. That's because I have luck as well. Huh? Even I possess a talent as boring as Yeah, okay, this does not sound like Hajime. What? <laughs> what? What is going on, dude? P possess huh? I'm starting to get really interested. Who are you? You're obviously from Hope Peak Academy too, right? So you're one of us? Ah, but that's weird. This is the first time I've ever seen you. What? So this is not- wait, no, ah, uh, uh, whatever. Hey, can you tell me why you're here? How did you end up here? How boring. Ah, sorry. I'm often told I'm terrible at making conversations. Not you. This world. Huh? 
This world is full of boring people. People who lack talent stick together and oppress those who do possess talent. Even though they know they're insignificant, they don't try to acknowledge their true superiors. They are profoundly desperate to drag them down to their level. And because of these bastards, this world has come to deadlock. This world has stopped evolving. How boring. This is not Hajime. Yep. As a matter of fact, this is none of the 16 students. Like... What? Well, the world is shaped by the will of the majority. It makes sense that it bends to those who lack talent. That's why we're in our present situation. Uh, perhaps. Does that have anything to do with the re reason you're here? Boring people make no contributions to the world. Not even a speck of dust. That's why my teachers taught me that a certain degree of selection must be performed. Looks like they had high expectations for you, huh? That's completely different from me. But, what are you planning to do? Now that you've ended up like this, there's nothing you can do, right? Listen well. Using people is a talent too. It is now my turn to use that person, just as they used me in the past. That sounds like a really big clue right there. This sounds to me like this is the ultimate impost- Oh yeah, I totally forgot. We ha- we still haven't- We still don't know anything about that. The ultimate imposter. Right. So, hold on. So, that person must obviously be Byakuya, surely. Just as they used me in the past. Huh. The question is, who's they? That person. Are you talking about ultimate despair? Huh? But how? I mean, they're already... I have it with me. The contribution that person left to me. Even now, it rests in my pocket. What the heck? I, I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> I'm definitely lucky. I can't believe I'm speaking with someone as amazing as you. Yeah, I mean, I'm actually intrigued as well. I, what the... Then, will I be able to see her again? No way. What is going on? You're telling me Junko is alive? Or no, I mean, uh, Junko's not the only despair girl, right? Unless... I, uh, will I be able to see the person I hate with every fiber of my bot being again? Yeah, he's definitely talking about Nagito. I mean, uh, Junko. And did Hajime always have manicures? What the? What's with his nails? And this time... Will I be able to kill her this time? The person I hate so much? I would love to see Junko versus Nagito. That would actually be incredible, but... What is going on here, dude? Hate? Then... Explain your hand. <laughs> I was gonna say. Yeah, that looks like Junko's hand, too. Ah, uh, this? The end of that bandage. Oh, bandage. Oh. It's a woman's hand, right? Uh... Okay? Um... <laughs> yeah, okay, um... Isn't it amazing? I can't move it, of course. I mean, it's not my hand after all. What? I am so... I... What? Okay. What is the... Uh, what? Wait, does this apply... Is this before or after he killed himself? I... But even now, it still hasn't rotted. Hey, maybe that means it's becoming one with me. Isn't it amazing? I have successfully become one with ultimate despair. My sworn enemy... No way. That's Junko's hand, isn't it? What? I see. You salvaged the body. You really are a boring person. Uh, I don't want you to misunderstand. I just see her as my enemy, you know. Because she's my sworn enemy. Because I hate her so much. That's why I took her power, and for that I... Wait, huh? Do I... hate her? Huh. That's strange. Huh? Oh, he must be losing his memories somehow. Huh, 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 huh? Ah, look at the window. We're finally here. You're starting to see it too, right? That's Jabberwock Island, isn't it? 
Isn't it exciting? I wonder what's going to happen on that island once we get there. Oh my... Uh, uh, okay. What's going to happen? I can already predict what will happen. Huh? I already know, because I am loved by talent. Um... Okay, but... But no matter what happens, it's of no concern to me. I will not be able to participate in what lies ahead. Huh? Really? I don't really understand, but... I guess we have to part ways for a while. That's disappointing. We seem to get along pretty well. Um, yeah, sure. Hey, can I see you again? There's no reason we'll ever meet again. After all, <laughs> you are boring. Um, okay, but... Your talents, your thoughts, your entire existence is boring to me. Wow, this makes Byakuya look like a, like a saint. You really don't play along, do you? Wow. That was actually a very interesting uh, scene right there. Wow, that was it? What? I am so lost. What? Okay, well... Okay, wow. Um... Oh god, um... I'm trying to f uh, forget Chiaki, but... <laughs> the game just does The game just had to shove her face at me. Man, to make things worse, I mean... Uh, the creator of this game knew that people would like Chiaki, and they decided to just shove it in our faces. <laughs> of course they did. But, I mean, oh man, it's crazy, because... How are we gonna move on? Because, like I said earlier, Chiaki and Nagito were like the two pillars that really moved this game forward. So, how are we gonna move on? I mean, it, it technically sort of answered my question. Because everyone's alive now, for some reason. Of course, we're probably in a fake world. And I feel like something happened in between while Nagito was asleep. I mean, not Nagito, Hajime was asleep. Because he slept for two days, right? I feel like something happened in between there. I, I mean, that's just my, you know, prediction, but... I, I don't understand. Like, are we in, like, a Sword Arts Online type of thing? Where we put, like, a... Uh, like a gear on our heads and we enter like a virtual world? I feel like that's the only explanation. I mean, there's no way that a regular human, like without any... Like, let, let, let's say you're just present, right? In the real world and you can't just like move yourself into a virtual world, right? You you would need some kind of technology, surely. I mean, I, I mean, there's so many questions. Monokuma's identity, Monokuma's motive, the future foundation. This w virtual world that we happen to be in. Who the hell was Nagito talking to? Uh, I can't imagine all of this being answered in one chapter though. So that's going to be very interesting. But yeah, rest in peace Chiaki. Um, but unfortunately, I'm, I'm, I feel like I'm going to have to see her again. So that's re that really sucks. I mean, man, they, they really had to do that. And to rub, rub more salt on the wound, they added Mahiru and... All the survivors. <laughs> I don't know, man. I, at this point, I just want this game to be over, to be honest. Uh, normally, I would say I don't want Danganronpa to be over, but this one hits differently. Um, so yeah, hopefully uh, we figure out the mysteries of this island and hopefully satisfy my curiosity. Anyways, if you guys enjoyed this video, please leave a like, comment, or subscribe. Thank you guys so much for watching, and hopefully I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.